Good morning. I wanted to talk today about a little bit of humor regarding the cape. Um, some things you will find that maybe you weren't expecting or things that are just capish and that's the way things are down here. First thing is um, in terms of heat. So yeah, sometimes you'll need to turn the heat on down here. I know we're balmier and it's a lot nicer on the cape, but sometimes we need to turn on the heat. So between the bridges, which is the um, upper cape and the outer cape, you'll find mostly gas heat um, and some electric baseboard between the bridge and say uh, Chatham and Brewster. And then once you get to the outer cape, it's much more common to see oil heat, probably because they never ran the gas lines out that far. And there was a moratorium on gas at one point down here. So a lot of the newer homes um, when they built them on the outer cape, they added gas, but uh, before that, there was mostly oil. Um, so that's one thing. The other thing is that there are no high rises down here. So that's part of the charm. It's quaint, it's charming, um, it's pretty when you drive around. You don't see um, a beach with tons of high rises towering over it, which is part of what's so charming about being down here. And it's also part of what makes housing so difficult. Um, you can't go up, so you have to kind of spread out and that all that land is taken. So that's kind of why there's such a crunch right now. Um, it's very humid. Embrace it, you gotta live with it. I always have a ponytail or a bun because I have very curly hair and I look like Bozo if I don't put it back. And finally, um, the big thing down here is the outdoor shower. I personally am a huge fan. I think that they are going to catch on outside of the Cape. I know that we're starting to see them. I have a brother-in-law who loved ours so much. He went and bought one up in Maine. So they're huge. They're very popular. Don't knock it till you tried it. They're awesome. Have a great week, everybody. Enjoy the Cape.